Good day and a warm welcome to the second part of the demo video for the Leak Detector Family LD500 and LD510. Today we would like to show you how easy the setup and usage of the Leak Detector really is. To start off, we would like to show you how the configuration of the instrument works. In order to get to the configuration menu, you need to press the home button tab on the main screen. Once inside the configuration menu, the instrument can be set up individually for each side. The national standard can be selected as well as the cost per volume, the local currency and the annual running hours of the compressed air system. The sub-menu labeled Parameters is there to select the correct sensor which is currently attached to the instrument. The selection of the right sensor for each measuring task is explained in detail during our first demo video. The running pressure of the compressed air system needs to be selected as well as the approximate distance to the leak. In order to simplify the repair and description of each leak, individual information for each leak can be saved into the instrument. Company name, building name and leak location can be described in great detail, making it easy for the repair team to locate each described leak. The leak counter can also be set individually. After everything is set up correctly, the user can start with the leak audit. In the top left corner of the main screen, the intensity of each leak is indicated. The level indicated is the intensity of each leak measured in decibel. The loss indicated is the amount of air which is lost at this particular leak location. The cost indicated is equivalent to the savings potential if the particular leak were to be repaired. The sensitivity level of the instrument can be adjusted in the top right corner of the main screen. The sensitivity levels are usually automatically adjusted by the instrument. This function helps to keep the instrument in the correct measuring range, cancelling out as much background noise as possible. The color and size changing circles in the middle of the screen make it easy to locate and zoom in onto an existing leak. Alternatively, the compressed air system can be scanned systematically. After the leak is located, it can be described and catalogued. If necessary, adjustments to the configuration can be carried out for each leak. For example, details describing the leak location like company name, building and leak location can be adjusted as well as the important parameters of system pressure and distance to the leak. Even the attached sensor can be changed for each individual leak location. Finally, all parameters can be double checked for accuracy before storing the leak description. After the repair of a leak, the LD500 or 510 can be used to verify the leak tightness. After the air audit is completed, all saved data can be exported to a USB stick. The start and end points of each export are freely selectable. The next video will focus on the evaluation of the saved data. The third video will look at and explain how easy it is to generate a leak report with the Leak Reporter software. We thank you for your attention and happy leak finding!